My name is Lily Camp. I major in biology and I minor in wildlife rehab and I compete in snowboard alpine. My first race was our, our last season and it was in the adult league that they host here at Beach um, during the season. It was my first race ever. I didn't know what side of the gate to go around. I was freaking out. It's like I almost relearned how to snowboard. I was having to calculate when I turn, where I turn, where my body's positioned. Like I had to do all of that while like going through the course and like, I mean, progressively I would get better, but I did have um, a mentor like through my first season last season, um, Lily Bauer, she was um, a senior and she, she won quite a few national titles um, last season. So I had her kind of like pull me through this process, kind of guide me in, in a way to where I could like learn on my own, but also like follow in the footsteps of someone who, who's been familiar with it for a little longer than me. Uh, the season, in my opinion, started kind of slow for me. I was kind of getting back into it from last season, um, from our last nationals. I had a quite a bit of anxiety, you know, to perform the same way. After that, we started doing practices and then I started to realize that, I know, worrying about it too much just makes it harder. Um, so you just gotta, you just gotta be relaxed and you just gotta go for it with what you know how to do. Our ski and snowboard team um, competes in the Southeast Conference of USCSA um, and they put together about six events throughout the season and um, they hosted our nationals as well out in Mammoth, California. Having the teammates is a lot of fun. Um, I couldn't imagine competing all by myself, like that, that takes away from it I feel like. Um, but having just the boys out there doing their thing, um, pulling in the W's. In this past regionals, um, the boys pulled in a podium sweep as well as the women. Um, we went one, two, and three um, this regionals as well as last regionals. Um, so it's really cool to be part of a team, you know, that, that, that really makes, does some success out there and we just have a great time. Um, celebrating it all. storms aren't just bringing record rainfall to California. We are seeing historic amounts of snow that includes up at Mammoth Mountain, which was actually closed today because of too much snow and very dangerous conditions as crews there work overtime to clear the streets. I was just so ready to race and they all got canceled. I put in so much practice in the last week, morning, night, morning, night, like going through those gates, setting them up, tearing them down. And then only border cross ends up happening for nationals. Um, so I kind of had to regroup everything. But that, to me, was one of the more, more uh, nerve wracking events. At nationals for our border cross competition, they uh, open it up for inspection. Um, so as we were inspecting the course, which, which means we kind of slide through it nice and slow, um, kind of see where things are laid out. Um, talk about strategy, talk about um, all the things you would want to look out for going through the course. Um, I was a nervous wreck going through that inspection. I have never seen a border cross course that long, nor had the opportunity to race one. Um, the beginning features were just massive, um, and there were just a couple of jumps that <laughs> Well, I haven't really had a lot of experience on, but as soon as I went through it, it was it was kind of it was fun. I was having fun at that point. I was it was it wasn't didn't feel like competition anymore. All my friends were there. Yeah, as soon as I was there, I was kind of I was having fun. I wasn't worried anymore and then I went through the course and then I came out on top and was border cross national champion. 2023 USCSA Women's Border Cross National Champion from Lee's McCray College. Let's hear it for Lily Camp. I have another season ahead of me, possibly two. 
I plan on hopefully, since I'm nearing my the end of my um, career here at Lee's McRae, my uh, course load will get a little lighter. I'll be able to balance things a little better and, you know, um, take a little bit more time for myself because that's always needed. And continue with my success, hopefully, in the classroom and on the slopes and put in all the work there. I'm excited to get back out there next season and start working. I learned that it's all a mentality. Like, everything you are contemplating or scared of, that's your obstacle. Like, that's what you need to overcome. I really was just out there to have fun this season, and I mean, I put in the work and practice, and I, and I, I mean, I worked hard, but I think my mentality was what would get in my way, and that's what I learned, that you have to really open up um, and be aware of that, you know, that mentally is how you perceive it all and how you get over fear and how you really push through everything.